वेलकम टू ऑल ऑफ यू आई एम सुमित गुप्ता अ स्विंग ट्रेडिंग कोच ट्रेनर एंड ऑथर एंड आई बीन ट्रेडिंग स्टॉक मार्केट फॉर मोर देन 15 इयर्स टुडे इन दिस वीडियो व्हाट आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विद यू इज अ कांसेप्ट ऑफ व्हाट आर फ्यूचर्स एंड ऑप्शंस आई एम श्योर यू वुड हैव हर्ड ऑफ इट यू माइट हैव बीन इंट्रिग्ड बाय दीस टर्म्स एंड यू माइट हैव वांटेड टू नो व्हाट डू दीस रियली मीन एंड इफ यू आर अ ट्रेडर और इफ यू हैव ऑलरेडी बीन ट्रेडिंग इनटू दीस इक्विटी मार्केट्स आई यू नो हाउ यू कैन यूज दीस futures and options for trading okay first of all before i go uh, let me put a disclaimer the futures and options are for the advanced traders right these are something that you should try only once you have had good experience in trading in the normal uh, segments which is equity or it could be foreign currency uh, foreign currency is generally the future contracts only so it's uh, generally get your arms around you the normal trading first and then only jump into the futures and options okay now futures and options are basically derivatives okay they are not an asset in themselves like for example when you buy a share of a company okay let's say infosys for example so you bought one share of infosys you paid about 1600 rupees for that okay so you own that share you have that one particular share with you okay and the futures and options will be a derivative of that share okay uh and the when i say derivative means uh, let me give a very simple example of uh, from your general life what is the derivative so the derivative is basically like you have milk right so milk is a product milk is a natural product that comes in right is the first thing that comes uh, as a as a primary thing right so milk comes in because you obtain milk from a cow or a buffalo wherever it comes from right uh, uh, and then from that milk you can create many uh, things right which are called derivatives for example curd for example butter for example cheese these are the derivatives of milk similarly when you talk about crude oil crude oil is the uh, is the natural form in which you extract it right which is the primary forms first of all that crude oil is available then you know you can get kerosene diesel or petrol out of that thing so petrol diesel and kerosene in this example would be the derivatives of crude oil understood so similarly these uh, uh, futures and options are derivatives of that particular share or currency or commodity that you might be trading okay so whatever these are derivative of are called underlying so similarly in an example if you bought a if there is a share of uh, of infosys then that infosys is underlying and any future or option contract will be a derivative of this underlying which is infosys okay so this is the terminology so there are certain terms which you have to understand you will hear contract now contract means because these are derivatives and you do not own anything you do not own a future contract you do not own an option contract these are basically only uh, contracts there is no asset basically now when we talk about future contract basically it is that today you are buying a future contract and i will be talking more purely purely from a stock trading perspective okay so you can trade in futures okay so instead of buying the share itself you can buy a future contract of uh, the uh, of the underlying like in infosys right and then they, that contract will have an expiry date it will be for a particular month okay so you could have have that for you know uh, one month two months three months like december january february uh, are the contracts that you might have available right now right so those will be the contracts for that month and usually these contracts expire on the last thursday of each month in india okay this is their expiry date okay so normally what you will see it you will see it as you know infosys 20 uh, uh, you know x december 22 uh, is is the uh, is is what the contract will be okay ft may also be the word so that means it's a future contract of infosys which is expiring on that x date of december whatever and that usually would be the thursday last thursday of the month uh, for which is the count off so that's that's how it works okay same thing is with options also now in options what happens is ki uh, these are basically a right okay a right 
which basically if you are into that contract of options you can convert that into uh, you know you can buy either by if you are uh, having a call option then you can buy that option uh, 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 you know exercise that option and buy shares of that particular like if you buy a call option of infosys you can pay that strike price and you can buy it okay so options are also kind of derivative and on options unlike futures you have to pay a premium okay so what i will be doing is this is the brief terminology that i wanted to share with you okay now uh, how the price is determined and uh, uh, how, what are the more details of these i will be talking in later videos when i'll talk about specifically about future and specifically about options in a separate video because these are to be explained a little bit right but for now futures and options are derivative of a particular underlying and that underlying could be a share commodity or a currency right now what are the benefits of futures and options the benefit of futures and options is that you the money that you have to invest for the same number of shares okay for trading in the same number of shares is much lower right in case of futures it is generally around like 15 16% to 30% is what you will have to put in which is called a margin okay and in case of options it will further be you know just a premium you have to pay over the this thing which is again you know might be 1 1 to 2% kind of thing depending on when you are buying that contract right and the expiry so i'll talk about in these in more detail keep coming back to uh, learn about futures and options in more detail which i'll be talking about in my later videos and uh, i hope uh, you got some information out of this uh, so uh, share uh, these these videos like subscribe and uh, you know in case you want to learn more about swing trading and how you can use swing trading as a vehicle to your uh, you know achieving financial goals you can join one of my webinars link for which is given below in the description just uh, come in or you can join one of my courses uh, again the details of which are available on my website okay so wish you all the best have a great day and i look forward to speak to you once again so